Greetings YouTube. Today we're going to show off a classic Star Trek figure. It's a reproduction. This is from 1991 um, from the Zorn uh, from the Star Trek universe and I fell in love with this episode when I first saw it because again I love anthropomorphic characters. Um, this is a completely static figure. There is no uh, movement of any kind and apparently I paid four dollars for it at one point. Um, it has the recording device here, uh, which was supposed to be used for them to be able to communicate with the, the, the uh, their ship. Um, these wonderful gold-like outfit, arm guards here, uh, a belt, and uh, no other equipment other than that classic dagger he makes out of stone and of course it's the unsophisticated nature of the of the of the character in the film he makes a hand weapon a very effective hand weapon but a hand weapon to go after captain kirk and you have the the skull ridges here the pronounced brow ridge and the faceted very much non-reptilian eye which which combination of reptile and insect traits really gave it an alien look and the big nasty Ma, um, I thought these characters were. This character was so cool, almost like awesome. Um, because again, I love anthropomorphic characters. Uh, this at one time was, you know, a proud, uh, proudly on display in my office. Um, but I just don't have this as much display space as I did at one time. Um, and I don't, I don't think I ever collected any other characters that they reissued um, when they made these in '91. Uh, but. Uh, this one I, I thought was, was just something I had to own because it made me remember the first series because I can remember the, f the original Star Trek series, the last season, seeing it first run. Um, yeah, folks, I'm old. <laughs> 